everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is London and I love budgeting. Um, and so I have been recently using the cash envelope system and I made a TikTok and it actually did pretty well and a lot of people had questions. So I'm going to film and just show you how I would do a cash envelope stuffing. Um, this is not a paycheck. This is actually a old emergency budget that I had built with Dave Ramsey and some of it had been moved to savings and so we have a little bit left over and I thought what a great way to spread it amongst my sinking funds so I can build those and bulk those up. So the first thing I'm going to do is count because I'm not sure how much there is. I know that there's a hundred. So $2.97, almost $300 we are going to stuff today in my sinking funds. So the way that I budget is I use my iPad and I have it all in my budgeting system um, that I got off of Etsy, which I'll link down below. Like I said, this has already been tithed on. This is all extra money from my old emergency fund kept in this envelope. So... Um, I'm going to be spreading it amongst all of my sinking funds and I'm so excited to bulk these up. I'm actually going to add another sinking fund because my sister's bachelorette party is in a week and I'd like to have a little bit of money to spend. So this is where I have my sinking funds and we have $2.97. So I'm going to go ahead and pull up. I've got my GoodNotes app. I'm gonna pull out, okay, good notes app, got my calculator. So a trick is if you have your good notes app up and you pull your calculator to the side, you can do your calculations with your planner open. So whatever we have left over is going into the bachelorette fund. So I don't actually have a envelope for that. But let's just go ahead and get stuffing. This is my favorite part. I look forward to getting paid every month, not just to get money, but also to stuff my envelopes. Let me get situated and I'll be right back. Okay, so this is my current envelope binder. This is my sinking fund binder. Um, I have a wallet with actual envelopes in it for, for my everyday to day spending. However, this is what I use for my sinking funds. I got it off of Amazon. Do not judge my handwriting. I know it's awful, but we, you know, that's not what it's about. It's about saving money and learning how to budget with what you have. So this is how I have it set up. I have it in order by what I have on my iPad. So it should be pretty easy. First, we are gonna stuff beauty. Beauty, we have $25 going in. So I'm going to take 20 and I'm going to take five ones. Two, three, four, five. So let's double check. 20, one, two, three, four, five. And I have nothing in beauty because I just got my nails done yesterday. So that is all gone. I'd like to beef it up. I think I'm going to in the next um, video where I stuff my actual paycheck. So that is stuffed and ready to go. And we've got 25 and beauty. Okay. In car, I'm going to be putting another 25. I've already got a bit of cash in there. So I'm going to try and keep it as minimal as possible with another 20 rather than two tens. So let's see, 21, two, three, four, five, perfect. And I'm gonna go ahead and count through what I have so you guys can see how much we have saved so far. So, um, let me get this situated. Perfect, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. 
Okay, so we have 137 in this envelope, and that feels so good, you guys, because, like I said, we just had to spend, let's see, I actually have the receipts here. So total, we had to spend $46. And then we also had to get our registration. So it took a, a good bit of our money, but we're gonna build it back up and it's going to be okay. That's why I love sinking funds so much because you're ready for anything. If you need to go out and get an oil change, you're set. You don't have to worry about what paycheck it's coming from or, you know, stuff like that. Okay, so next we're going to be stuffing the baby fund. Um, like I said, I am not pregnant. This is just for the future. So let's go ahead and count with what we have in here. We're adding 10. So we've got 20, 40, 50, five. Wow, it's crazy how fast this stuff stacks up. Now, I thought I would just let you guys know, I just started doing this two weeks ago again. I did it about a year ago for a long time, um, but, oh gosh, I already forgot what I did. Jeez, 55. Okay, um, yeah, so I've done it for a while before, and I just stopped, and then I found out I was spending way too much money on like luxury items, and I just should not be spending that kind of money. So this is a good way for me to keep accountable and see all of my funds. This is what I have and that is all I have. Now, obviously I do have savings and I do have a checking account. However, this helps me keep everything that I need on a day-to-day -day basis or monthly basis. Like you'll see, I have pet food, things like that. So yes, I do have money in savings. I do have money in retirement. But this is just what I do. Um, to maintain like daily living. So now that that is out of the way, um, I did have some comments on my TikTok video that was like, you know, if you put it in a savings account, you can accrue interest. Yes, I understand that. And I do have money in a savings account, but this is good for me. And it's what works for me. Things that I know are going to come up. Um, this is how I save for it. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30, 40, 142. So we have $142. We're adding 100. So now we have $242, which I just bought some plane tickets. <laughs> so unfortunately, this is about to be deposited into the bank. But, you know, it's nice to have right now. <laughs> it feels good. Okay, so we have 242 for now. All right, next is my shopping envelope. Currently I have $20 in it. We're going to be stuffing another 20, yeah, 40. So we'll go ahead and stuff this. So shopping has 40 in it. Okay, next we have dental. Now you may be wondering, why do you have a separate envelope for dental? It's because I know that I need to have a crown on a tooth coming up very soon. So I've been stocking up and this should be, my, well, I've got a long way to go, let's be honest. Okay, um, so in dental we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 190, 192, 93, 94, 495 so 200 total this is a five 200 total and we are going to be adding 10 so we'll have 210 which is exciting just one more step closer to getting that fully funded all right pets is next I do have two precious dogs they are like my children um and their food one of them has allergies so she has a food that is prescribed which is pretty expensive so i'm going to add another 20 and we have 60 dollars in pets sorry 20 40 60 60 dollars in pets i know a lot of people like to watch you count it out 
Um, I also like watching these videos, so that is why I decided to start my own channel. So, let's see, $60. Okay, Christmas is out of order, but that's okay. So Christmas, we have um, recently started saving for Christmas, I think in the last paycheck I started this one. Um, so I have $50 in so far, so 20 30 40 50 and we are just going to be adding another 10 to make it 60 and I really like having this this was something I saw on one of another youtubers channels I saw they started saving for Christmas and I thought wow that's genius because I always struggle with Christmas I'm like oh let me just use my whole paycheck to buy everyone Christmas presents and that's not how it should be so I think that this is a wise decision um, okay, going back to house. So we are going to put $10 in it. Let's see what we have so far. 10, 20, so 40, 20, 30, 40. And we're going to add a 10. So we have 50. And putting it in house. The last one is my savings challenge. I'm not gonna put anything in this. I do this weekly for my paychecks, but I do wanna get an envelope for Disney. So I'm going to go ahead and pull the 10 for Disney. But for the bachelorette trip, let's go ahead and count what we have left over. And that is going to go in my wallet. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57. So we have $57 going in. And we have $57 total because I have not saved for that at all. Uh, and we got 10 for Disney as well. So that is it, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope that you tune in next week for my actual paycheck stuffing. So that's going to be super fun. I'm really, really excited to show you what I use in my cash envelopes and my sinking funds and my bills and, you know, it's all the fun stuff. So be sure to tune in, and I will talk to you guys next week.